Hi guys, I'm Ishan Panda. And I'm Anshuman Prakash. Second year students at IPM, I'm Indore. And you must have already heard a lot about startups or read about them in some article or some newsletter. But did you know that I am Indore and especially IPM is emerging as one of the new startup hubs of India with already three to four very successful and profitable startups. And today we, with us, we have a founding member of one such startup, Mr. Raghav Tripathi from Infani Consulting. So you're watching the Supergrats YouTube channel and let's get right into the video. Hi guys, today we have with us Mr. Raghav Tripathi, one of the founding members of Infani Consulting. So the first question our viewers would have for you is, what is Infani Consulting? Okay, so Infani uh, is a consulting firm of venture that uh, me and four of my friends here at IIM Indore, we conceived it uh, and we are managing it uh, currently. Uh, it basically what it does is uh, it helps startups and MSMEs in whatever the need is. Uh, let's say it be product, it be strategy, marketing, all uh, market research. Uh, these are the things which we consult uh, from small startups and MSMEs especially. So Raghav, as we know that startup like takes a lot. It takes new ideas. It takes a new courage to start a new thing. So uh, what made you decide to do this, and what is its origin story? Okay, so the origin story is uh, quite interesting. Uh, what happened was uh, uh, when we were in our first year, uh, what we were doing, we were uh, me and my friends, we were doing uh, internships at various startups. Uh, I was doing a FABC venture builders. My friend Sambad and Devarnab, they were doing a rule pay. And two of my friends, uh, they were doing a creative internship. And my friend Chirag, uh, he uh, himself has a business and he was also interning at Zeta. Uh, so the thing was, uh, we thought, okay, we are doing in different uh, aspects of a, a product, a company. Okay, what we can do, we can pull our competencies, we can have this synergy that we have because of, we are friends already and we know different uh, aspects or different parts of a, what it goes into a company, what uh, scale, how can we provide scale to a startup basically in different aspects. Uh, so we thought, okay, let's just together form a company, form a growth uh, which can help other companies in turn to grow their startups. I mean, as Anshuman said, definitely starting a new startup from scratch, something has never been done before. It's always a very hard process. So what was the biggest challenge you guys faced as a group when starting Infinite Uncertain? Uh, okay, so first of all, uh, I would say the biggest problem was stakeholder management. Uh, when we were deciding, like we had two uh, clients uh, and we were on any aspect of it, we were deciding, okay, what should be our game plan? What should be our game plan? Okay, how should we go ahead with, uh, what idea should we uh, provide them? So we used to distract, uh, discuss it amongst uh, ourselves. So what used to happen was uh, someone has a different idea because they're from a different background. Okay, they have done something in marketing, say, uh, and someone's from growth, and they are saying, okay, this won't work. Let's do this. So stakeholder management, uh, I would say, was one of the biggest problems uh, when we started it. And uh, in starting up, I won't say because ours is not a very money intensive uh, startup. We didn't have to like put in any capital, so that was the easy part for us. So, uh, Raghav, किसी भी startup की successful होने के लिए, मतलब uh, starting में ऐसा होता है जब उसमें आता है कि कितना support नहीं मिलता है। So, how do you think the IBM environment is it supportive of startup? Oh, okay, so uh, this might be uh, the thing is uh, IBM we don't get much time to do things out of our academics and the things that we have like our PRs and all. Uh, so the thing uh, was uh, like. We have to manage time. We have to like, uh, what does a B school teach you? It is it teaches you to how to prioritize the time. Okay, it is easy. Okay, so you want to do this? You can do it. Uh, no one's stopping you to do it. What do you have to do? Just like switch your priorities. Okay. So like uh, when we started up, my grades took a hit. Like now they're back up again. That's a different thing. But uh, the thing is uh, very simple. If you are doing something, you are shifting your priorities. Something is gonna have to change. Okay. Uh, so what we did, like uh, we first of all, like we, we thought, okay, let's put Infinite as our uh, topmost priority, and we'll look at our other things. Uh, but now we have started managed it. Well, like uh, it's been good. We have managed it wonderfully. Our grades are back up again. We are doing internships. We are doing Infinite. Uh, some of my friends they are holding PRs and all. Yeah, it's going well. I mean, I feel like we've been. Uh long way into this interview. I feel like our viewers and both both of us are still curious. What does the name Infinite mean in Infinite Consulting? Like how did you come up with this name? Okay, so we were discussing uh, the names, okay, what should we uh, name it, okay. So my friend was like, okay, 
we hope like someone sa among us uh, someone is watching that movie uh, uh, based on uh, uh, shrinivasan ramanujan the man who knew infinity yeah yeah, yeah that's that movie started so we thought okay let's do something uh, what we are going to do we are going to scale a startup we are going to help startups go to moon okay go to infinity okay so what should we do okay. uh, we want to be able to find like the domain name and the company name uh, as infinity consulting so we thought okay let's just uh, drop that team why and have it as infinity consulting so yeah, that's, that's, that, that's really interesting so uh, rather uh, Like it has been a couple of months you working in it and in Fahad. Yeah. So till now, what has what has been your greatest memory with your with your like friends? Okay. So greatest memory. Or like should we call them founding members? Founding, founding members. members. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. So my friends, my founding members, colleagues. Uh, like uh, memories are. Uh, it's it's been not uh, long uh, back long. Uh, so what would I say? It's it basically how we work together. Okay. We are doing uh, a project like. We have to present it so tomorrow. We are doing it late at 3 a.m. Thing. So that's like uh, one of the uh, uh, we have spent like uh, two or three uh, pulled an all nighter doing the work, going to classes, coming back, presenting to a, a client, then reiterating it, and it's like yeah. So the hectic part it became yeah. It's one of the memories. So do you feel like the work you put is worth it, and you are seeing results? It's like it must be such a joy to see a company coming into fruition. So now that you've been in this business for like a time now, you you show you guys when you start, you must have a vision, right? For starting this company. So where do you see Infinite Consulting? Maybe like a year from now, and what are your future goals? Like the main goals of this company? Okay, so uh, the thing is, what we thought, okay. Uh, at first like the very beginning of it we thought okay uh, what we can do uh, we can have infinity as uh, a company like we have some other consulting clubs that uh, uh, pull together different colleges and take out uh, children from them and train them in consulting or something so we thought okay we can do something like that we started and now what our future plans are basically to hire someone to hire some people okay basically from our colleges from other colleges in our own area from you Uh, to train them what we have learned and uh, like basically it will be something that school students school students or basic college students can do in their time in that uh, like after school after colleges and which will help them to gain a corporate experience that's what we are thinking as of now so raghav uh, infinite mein kaam karte karte you must have learned a lot you must have had new experiences so uh, but sab kuch is achhi lagti hai kuch is kharab lagti hai तो अगर पास में जाके देर वॉज दिस वन थिंग एट यू कुड टेल योर सेल्फ टू दैट दैट यू नो नाउ बट यू डिट नो बैक देन सो वॉट डू इट बी या सो दिस इज वेरी ट्रू वॉट आई वुड से टू माई पास सेल्फ कीप एन ओपन माइंड ओके यू डोंट नो एवरी थिंग लाइक एज पर्सनली टू माई सेल्फ एंड नॉ द पर्सन इन फ्रंट इफ यू नोज एवरी थिंग वट यू हैव टू डू कीप एन ओपन माइंड टेक द आइडियाज इन इवेल्युएट दैन एंड डू वॉट्स बेस्ट वट यू थिंक यू ऑल टूगेदर फॉर मा कंसेंसिस And do what you feel the best. I mean, I'm sure after hearing your story and how you guys started a company from scratch, a lot of our viewers who are either in colleges or are aspiring to be in IPM in the future would also like to know how can they go through this process and become entrepreneurs themselves. So, do you have any advice for these young budding prospects who are pursuing their new ideas and passions? Okay, so uh, I would say if you want to pursue entrepreneurship. If you want to build something, that's like one of the brilliant, uh, one of the like most uh, innovative, one of the most novel things you can do. If you're building something from scratch, you are basically creating wealth. This is where wealth creation, value creation starts. Uh, it's a very fantastic thing. Uh, just like have an idea. It's very easy to say have an idea. You can't have an idea. See a problem. You are uh, like uh, people are going somewhere. Okay, they are facing a problem. Just think, how can we solve this problem? It basically starts from there, okay. Or uh, like think, uh, there's another way to think about ideas or uh, like uh, how to build a startup. Uh, you can think about how you can uh, club something, how you can merge something, how can you remove something. Okay, so there's this uh, very big assembly line or very big chain. Like this goes from this, this goes from this. How can you remove this? How can you automate this? How can you scale it? Uh, that's one more thing you can think about. It was a lovely experience to have you here. I'm sure our viewers learned a lot about not only your company but about startups in general. How, as college students, even we can pursue these ideas. It was again a very pleasure to have you here. Thanks. Thank you, Raghav. Thank you. Thank you.